Hello, I am Ronald Ogden. Today on Pop Tropica, how to beat Spy Island. Come with me as I show you how to take out your enemy. Now that we are on Spy Island, I must take American accent. I have been assigned American role on this op. Goodbye and say hello to my American accent. Once on the island, move to the right and enter the headquarters. Jump to the very top and let's talk to Director D. After a short scene, Director D will give you a decoder kit so you can speak with other spies. Exit the headquarters and jump to the roof. Once on the roof, there's a spy up there. He has an important message for you. This minigame will occur many times over the course of the island. Solution is relatively simple. In this first decoder puzzle, line up green O with red K. That makes the message relatively clear. Opposite direction. Jump off the roof and enter Spyglass Eyewear. Speak with Dr. Spyglass and he'll give you an eye exam. Now all we have to do is whichever symbol he points to, point to the symbol in the opposite direction. Now this is a randomized selection, so just make sure to select each symbol opposite of the other and you'll be perfectly fine. He tells you to meet him at the top of the store. Exit the store, climb the ladder, and enter the building. Dr. Spyglass will give you a chameleon suit. What better for a spy than a chameleon suit? Put that puppy on. Exit the eyeglass store and move to the left till you reach the docks. Speak with the man in the trash can. He kind of looks like Oscar. The Grouch, that is. This decoder minigame's key is quite simple. Line up the O with the red Y. Once we've done that, we realize that the solution is on the roof. There's a secret entrance to the warehouse on the roof. Now move to the left and make your way to the top of the warehouse. Now be careful of these patrolling men. They'll hurt you. Use your chameleon suit and get to the top of the roof. Once inside, you've got to get past the three guard dogs. This is also pretty simple. Walk as far right as you can and stop once the dog comes by. The chameleon suit will protect you. Repeat this two more times until you get to the bottom of the building. Be careful. If you're bitten, it'll jump you up to the next level and you have to start over again. Stay on the upper chamber and jump all the way to the left and enter the vault. Help your spy fellow up and he'll give you a laser pen. I am sorry, teacher. My laser pen burned my homework. Once you've gotten the satellite clue and the laser pen, exit the top of the vault and go out of the doors at the bottom. Move back to the right towards headquarters. Go down to Baldwin Avenue until you see the man hiding in the bushes. He'll give you another message. The green F with the red L. Once we've lined up the letters and type out the message, we realize this message is fingerprint. There's a top BAD agent in the bistro. To access the BAD control center, you'll need his fingerprint. Move to the other side of the building to the other spy hiding in the bushes. He'll give you an X file. Move to the right towards Toupee Trace. Once there, you'll see a file X and some strange lettering read like this. Open up file X. File X warns you, don't trust director D. Now why would somebody give us that file? This is very curious. Now that we know not to trust director D, we have got to get into these headquarters. Obviously, because we're spies, we can't go in the front door. 
The key is to get to the top. Now, this will be very difficult. When the lights are on, they'll electrocute you. Once at the top, click on the grate. Use that laser pen to burn your way in. Once inside the attic, move to the left and help your fellow agent. He'll give you the grappling bow tie. That'll be a lot of fun to use. Awesome. Put that on. In Russia, we do not have this. We need to get this. This is very good. Go outside and jump down to the main street. Move all the way to the left until you come to Bad Bistro. Now we have to infiltrate the bistro. Take off your chameleon suit. Once inside the bistro, move to the right and talk to the chef. Inquire about a job. Before he'll give you a job, he needs to make sure that you know what you're doing. This minigame is relatively simple. It's just a game of memory. Pay attention to which ingredient the chef points to in order. Then point to them yourself in the same order, just like Simon says. Once you're done there, your reward is a chef's hat. Congratulations, you now have a job as a chef. Put on the chef's hat and move to the left. Speak with the VAT agent. He'll ask for a refill. Now you've got his fingerprint. We need to make a hasty escape. Once back in the kitchen, hop up through the vent and use the lights to get past the BAD agent. Move outside and you're free. Now we have everything we need to infiltrate the BAD communication center. Now before we move forward, a few things about the grappling bow tie. It's relatively simple to use. When you're in the air, anywhere you target, the grappling bow tie will go. Now move to the right of the bad bistro to the grease monkey shop. Jump and use your grappling bow tie to get as high as you possibly can. Once you're in the building top, use the bottom left icon to aim your bow tie without jumping. The key is to get all the way to the top left of the area where there's a spy on a communication tower. Use your grappling bow tie to shoot all the way to the right. Go inside. We're in some kind of greenhouse. First things first, let's put on that chameleon suit again. The key to this mini game is using the flower pads to get the cherry bomb to the top left where the cage is before the cherry bomb explodes. Where is, as you say, Mario brother when you need him, eh? Once you get the cherry bomb to the cage, let it explode and you'll free your final agent friend. The agent will give you the final clue that you need, as well as some ultra vision goggles. Before we leave, let's look at all three clues. Line them up. And we'll see, there's only three words we need to know. Laser, hair, removal. Now that we have all the information we need, leave the greenhouse and go outside. Jump down to the ground level. Once you're on the ground level, move all the way to the right until we come to the bad control center. Enter the control center and put on your ultra vision goggles. Now be careful. This entire area is filled with red lasers that you can only see if you have the goggles on. Be patient and use your grappling hook. Avoid those lasers and get to the top portion of the bad control center. Once there, use the fingerprint on the glass to gain access to the bad control center. Once inside, now starts the mini boss. Once inside, dodge all the lasers to get to the control panel. When you're there, you're trapped. Oh no! What are we going to do? Oh, Director D, you shall save us. Thank you. 
Now let's get this teleporter working, eh? First password is laser, second one is hair, and our final one is removal. We've gotten the teleporter working. Awesome. Wait, why did Director D go in there without us? He's betraying us. I knew he was bad news. In Russia, traitor gets bunk on the head with gun. It's time for the final boss battle. There are four glowing golden orbs. Use these orbs to protect yourself from the flying robots. Once you've used all four orbs on four robots, now we enter the second phase, which is Director D himself. Use your grappling bow tie to grapple to the top until Director D comes by and bonks his head on the ceiling. Do this four times and you've won. Congratulations! That metal is yours. Wear it proudly for your country. Karu Shadabuta, or how you say, good job. I am Ron Ogden. Until next time.